Okay, I want to sit in the next chair over. See, I got a chair behind me from this chair. Okay, now I'm ready. Mr. Beast, I'm canceling you. And my opinion matters the most out of all everything that's been happening. Because something very devastating has happened to my life because of you. And I just, I just don't like, it just left a bad taste in my mouth, you know? I'm talking about your bars, your chocolate bars. Me and my friend were roasting them so bad that we felt bad about posting the video. So I don't have the original, but oh my God, your, your chocolate is horrible. Like... I guess you're trying to do less sugar or something, but that just made it taste, like, so plain. Like, even the ones that were more, I don't know, have more flavor was still awful. I found that at a fucking Ollie's. A fucking Ollie's. Good stuff cheap. Who the f- I didn't find your bars anywhere else. That should be- That should be- <laughs> Do you diss on yourself right there that your chocolate bars can only sell in Ollie's? That's where I f found your chocolate bars. I want my money back. As a matter of fact, why don't you give me everybody's money back that you have ever scammed out of them? And I'll keep it for myself because... Because that's what you did, and you got away with it. So why can I do it? I'm just playing, y'all. But seriously, guys, never try his chocolate bars. Holy shit. It just felt like there was no love in it. Just just like Mr. Beast's, vi Mr. Beast's videos. No love, just... A hollow shell of greed. That's exactly what his chocolate tasted like. It tasted like his soul. <laughs> and if you enjoyed this, please leave a like and subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you when you watch me again. Metaphorically.